Good morning, welcome back to a new video. We have some jobs we have to do before the snow and that includes getting all this wood in so it stays dry. As you see it's pretty dry because it's been quite dry days for a while so they have dried out. I mean three days they are dried out. They never really got that wet because these are impregnated so they really don't soak so much. Uh, I guess they repel water, I'm not sure but they're pretty dry. So yeah we're trying to get all of this done before snowstorm that has uh, arrived quicker than expected. It's already starting to snow, which was supposed to happen in like three days. Uh, but yeah, it came already. So we are gonna hurry up and get everything done because we have a lot of things outside and in the barn that cannot get frozen and the mines are gonna get really high. So we need to really get all those uh, things in the house, whatever needs to go in. Our basement's not done, but we need the potatoes to go somewhere. We never sorted them out. Uh, maybe we'll sort them out once the basement's done. If it gets done this year, but we are gonna really work hard. So yeah, let's get started. Uh, we need to cut a lot of firewood still that's stacked up. That is uh, scrap wood that needs to be cut up. And a lot more things to do in the barn. There's plenty to do. So yeah, let's get started. Our potatoes all healthy some rotten wow let's do a live stream what I see mouse mouse look at that I've been eating our potatoes filling up their bellies why they don't like apples why are they not eating apples what's better on a potato than on an apple okay let's bring them inside before mouses eat all of them yeah let's hope we have to go through them with the new basement yeah
next morning. Uh, it got way too dark yesterday to continue. And today is even more freezing. We have heavy minuses and it's starting to snow outside. It's snowing like all morning but just like tiny bits so not really adding up to anything. But uh, snow is coming so we need to prepare. And it's blowing wind directly in here. And you see snow pieces flying all the way like till the end. And we have a lot of things here we don't want to get wet. So we're just going to put a temporary kind of redneck style close up this hole with doors and pieces and things that are big and fast and uh, then we're gonna bring in the wood and lawnmowers it's getting really cold and uh, yeah we haven't finished the barn to have it secured from the snow we are a bit slow on these things it's hard to keep up with all the projects but yes uh, let's close this hole up and then we're gonna bring in the wood the lawnmowers and then we're gonna wash them another time because all the pipes are frozen so we can't really pressure wash the the pans the ones for the cutting grass so I'll maybe scrape them by hands and then clean them as soon as it gets like warmer so we can actually use the pump or I'll just have to literally clean them by hands and then paint them but yes let's move on close this hole get to the rest of the jobs got dark. I think that's pretty much it for today. Let's go sleepy. Yeah, just don't play with it. I'm not sure it was close. <laughs> so that is done for now and that's gonna hold it out. It's not looking the best. And it's not the most effective since we need to work on the engine that's outside and inside. But it's going to be fine until we need to push the tractor, split the tractor in half. We don't need to worry about it. We're going to do that in pluses if they ever come. Um, but yeah, we need to hurry up with the engine. We need to assemble it, get it running on that thing. Uh, but yeah, this is going to stop the like water, I would say. Snow coming in and everything's going to get white. And, and it's actually nice and calm in here. Now it's like no wind blowing here, no draft. So it feels really warm in here to work. But yeah, let's move on to the wood. Three, two, one. Perfect.
So, we are exhausted, we are done. We got everything that we wanted to get in before the snow, more or less. And uh, yeah, looks like everything is under the roof and all safe. All the wood is stacked and all these machines are in. So now that these get, get really snowed on, not like they were getting rained on before, of course they were, but I want to work on them in the winter and I don't want them covered in snow for don't know how long, so I'd rather have them under the roof. And also snow gets more into places that rain can't get because it blows under and in. So I'd rather want them in and I need to clean out the pants. I will do that another time. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and we're going to see you in the next time. We are going to sleep. Hopefully the plastics come back and the snow doesn't take too long. Yeah, in May it will come back. No. <laughs>